Hi, welcome to SBR Videos. I'm Peter Loshak. We are previewing a handful of games from uh, college football week, week nine right now with Joe Duffy from OffshoreInsiders.com. Right now we're going to cover uh, Ohio State, Penn State. Joe Duffy, thanks for being back with us. Thank you, Peter, for having me. All right, Joe, I can't say it enough. Every video I say it, you take every game that I ask you to take, which is tougher lines, obviously, than, uh, than the games where you get to choose what you, whatever you like and you, uh, and you believe you have an edge on, and that's what you at your website. Nevertheless, you've had a very impressive record with us long-term large sample size. But tell us quickly what the OffshoreInsiders.com is all about, where you do uh, have those uh, picks where you have a big edge. Yeah, there is a reason that I've been in this business full-time since 1988, since graduating from college, going back to the score phone days. I live and breathe handicapping. Been doing this a long time, professionally 27 years, but betting well before that. Uh, OffshoreInsiders.com is where you get 27 years of full-time winning experience, just like the pros bet. Penn State is a 13.5 point home underdog. That's up a bit from uh, from 13, and Ohio State covered four in a row now, and last week, as a big uh, home favorite, they were reportedly a, a sharp side, took sharp action, and uh, they did, of course, cover very easily covered by a mile so here they are uh, again as a big favorite but not in the stratosphere maybe uh, they're a sharp side again uh, this week Penn State though they are off a bye double digit home underdogs that's a little bit scary to uh, bet against what do you like here Joe no it, it is funny I, I actually looked that up double digit home underdogs off of consecutive losses uh, following a bye were not as good as I expected mm -hmm. because remember my general theory is the buys benefit teams that really need it the most and in fact, I actually added the parameter, a team with a winning percentage that has won at least two-thirds of their games, and it was not a good play at all. In fact, it turned out to be a go-against, which did surprise me. But in addition to that, and this could be a premium play, I honestly don't know if I knew for 100% certainly it's going to be a premium play. I'd be happy to tell you, but I'm leaning towards making this a premium play on Ohio State luck. Whether or not Ohio State has a realistic chance of sneaking into the playoffs if they run the table, we could debate that. That's irrelevant. The fact is they believe it, and they, they do have a possibility. But in order to achieve that, they are going to have to make some statements. They're going to have to blow some teams out. And yes, if Ohio State runs the table, including some very impressive high-profile wins, who knows what could happen. And uh, that is certainly the, uh, the case here where Penn State – they are all of a sudden, they've come down to earth. Ohio State, conversely, they've won four straight. They've scored 50 or more points in each game, getting more than 500 yards each time. And their margin of cover in their last four games, remember, margin of cover is a very important stat. They've covered their last four games by an average, an average of 20 points per game. Now, is that a fluke? No. Remember, Ohio State, you know, they, they had a, a Heisman candidate front runner at the beginning of the year, lost him a quarterback. You got JT Barrett is getting better and better. 17 touchdown passes, three last week, just one interception in those four games. So he's for Ohio State to think national championship, they got to crush teams. They got to continue to build on the confidence of Barrett. I think they are catching the Penn State team that was playing a little bit above their heads and now has come down to earth. I do think it is a good spot for Ohio State. They've shown under Urban Meyer they've got no compunction. They'll happily run the score up on teams. So I do expect this game to get ugly, and it's probably going to be a premium play. All right, well, we'll see where this line closes again. Last week, Ohio State, as a big favorite, was a notable sharp side. And in retrospect, uh, that, was, that was an easy winner, maybe two weeks in a row. Thanks so much, Joe. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year round, a real time Vegas style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.